Hello and welcome to a little bit of just a uh, build uh, video. We're just going to look around at what I've built. Um, I have Optifine, so the shaders are working on that, so I nicely downloaded that. So this is going to be just a pretty large castle. Um, the base, like that mountain, this water, and some other stuff was world edited. So I started out by world editing like a hill up and doing some replacing, but most of it was done by hand. Really, I started this a long time ago and just never really got to actually building anything past the first room you'll see. So I've done this the last two days and it's turned out really nicely. Um, the shader pack is, if I check, uh, Chopic. 13 I guess. I'm using the highest so that way not the uh, ultra so that way it will not be a uh, horrible FPS and then resource pack. The resource pack Chroma Hills that's what I'm using. Uh, it's pretty big but it seems really nice. Um, so yeah really good video. So this is the entry hall. It's not, really, it's not too much of a military fort castle. It's a lot of decorative stuff. So we have this uh, nice little garden entry hall. Um, I'll change it today and fly around later. I think it, some parts look better at night. Here we have, again, coming into this main, like, I guess, uh, cathedral we have here. It's pretty much the middle of the fortress. Yeah, some blue stained glass in the background. We have, um, let's see if I can get this without my cursor. Okay. Ah! Almost set. There we go. We have this, uh, tunnel that I started to put it here, but it's nice underground tunnels. Like, maybe if this was being attacked, you'd run to the tunnel and escape out that way. Uh, it's raining. Turn off the uh, weather. There we go. Yeah, it's annoying. It does that water blur if there's just a transparent block above you, not necessarily just in general. So you have the podium, the pulpit, whatever it's called, and some hues. A little general bedroom for like maybe the staff in here. It's some nice skylights. Looks pretty nice in my opinion. And one of the few accesses to the roof. Which, yeah, you can kind of see the entire thing here from the sky. Um, we have a little well here. At one point, there was going to be some underwater base or whatever down here. I don't know what's left. I didn't actually continue that. I should, uh,. Glow, so I know shaders do. Ah, sun, yeah, this is all that's here. At one point, there was something more lower. Oh well. Uh, but yeah, so that's what we have here. Just the well, some uh, stone walls going around, some mossy stone walls. Oh, there's this secret passageway. Let's see if we can get this first try. Yep, no way out from that way. You just have to come over here and enter the walls. So it's a ground to the wall. So then come over here to a tower. I think it looks really nice. Come up here, second floor where there's the actual windows that you might have noticed from out there. Those go all the way around the entire thing up to top of the castle which is I used labs and there's all the way up here anyways I can come back down here I have a little soldiers area bunk beds I really like what I did with those supports yesterday they look really nice and those lights will turn on only at night so if I did a time set day you know, they all turn off Let's keep it at here. This nice night time. We have this uh, blacksmith forge. 
suppose it might need a little bit of a torch. Um, maybe like right here. But yeah. Some lava, I guess. Who knows what they're doing. And then direct access to the wall because, you know, they probably need that. Yeah, the bunk beds have ladders to get up there. Although, I believe they're a bit too big. Yeah, you can't quite stand on them. Um, what's next? We have the garden, one of the, well, the only open air courtyard. It's the little fountain with some chairs, uh, some grass, and some trees. And then we have the, I guess, VIP family house. Whatever, whatever king or whoever owns this castle, they live here. Nice dining room, book room, a book nook. A kitchen for the chefs, a nice big open fire pit. Some little draining for the smoke. Nice window. Some pots and pans and stuff. Those are uh, paintings, I believe. It's just a texture pack that gives them. Some storage, maybe they have ingredients in there. Um, then we go upstairs to the second floor. We have in here a larger storeroom for the castle. And the bedrooms. Master bedroom. Turn the lights on and off. One of only place where you can actually control that manually. One small bedroom with some nice bookshelves. And then finally one bedroom with less books. Just chest bed swords yeah oh don't want that there uh, hmm I think that's pretty much it um only thing left to do is maybe look at it during the daytime and you know see it from down here a little bit more so you fly around It'll look really nice some that moonlight there oh that's very nice with the moon reflecting on the water but yeah, it's just a nice piece of work, I think. Really helped a lot by that texture pack. They, the creators just did a great job on it. Couldn't wouldn't be as good looking without them. I'll try to find links and put them in the description, maybe. Yeah, here's what... Uh, now, somewhere around here, there, that's where I started at some point. Little underground boat thing. Out there, maybe around here. Uh, I'll just do a bit of a dive around. Maybe we'll see it if it exists still. I don't know. I seem to remember maybe closing it up. Uh, no, not quite. Yeah, at one point, I was thinking of maybe having like. A little underground or underwater cave with access through the well in the city, and you'd go there and you could have like little boats or something. Uh huh. There's the bridge. Presumably wood was made functional, retract. Yeah, I think this took. Um, I don't know how long exactly it took. What took maybe a day or two. Set. Let's try that. That's a nice day. Yeah, I really like this shaders as opposed to a Sonic Ethers because mostly the way it looks in like a forest and their screenshots it looks a little bit nicer, warmer light or something. Yeah, and there's it from above. Oh yeah. No, I looked at the roof access. I suppose I might as well. Show this off a little bit since there is some jungle that we saw over here. The chunk loads. Yeah, I'm surprised that this is doing so well. It's nice. Oh. Yeah, that might be a little bit. But yeah, you can see it looks really nice, kind of early morning light. And so that's why I chose it. Looks like it looks really good. So yeah, other mod was Optifine. I'm pretty sure I mentioned that. So 
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Check out the rest of the channel. Have a good day. And goodbye.